hey guys welcome to my channel if you're new and welcome back if you're not so today i did a skincare routine because in under one of my videos someone actually asked for it so yeah i hope you guys enjoy the video if you do don't forget to like comment share and subscribe for more so yeah let's just get into the video okay so this is a video of me showing you guys what my skin actually looked like before um and i do want to say that these products are not the only thing that actually helped my skin i am on my oritane journey this is my third month and i have to go on oritane for eight months so yeah i'm gonna take you guys with me on that journey but after that eight months i'm gonna make an updated video so yeah let's get into it okay so the first thing that i use is i use the cerave sa smoothing cleanser and obviously the first thing that i'm gonna do is i'm gonna wet my face and apply the cleanser on my face um and i do the one minute rule thing which means that i obviously apply the cleanser on my face for like one minute straight and then i wash my face after um if you want to use that skincare spinning brush then i guess you could use that but me personally i don't use it because um it really has like a lot of disadvantages actually i've heard people say that you know um because it removes dead skin eh, then it might have dead skin on it um then you it might get dirty or something i don't know it's just so much with that brush you guys i don't even think that it's worth it so i just use my hands you know the old-fashioned way that everyone is used to so yeah i just use my hands And i just want to say guys i am not in any way shape or form a dermatologist so therefore i'm not telling anyone what to use on their skin i'm just showing you guys what i use for my skin what works for me and you know we all have different skin types so what works for someone else might not work for you so i would definitely recommend that you go and see a dermatologist about your skin because that's what i did but you know it was really trial and era for me um in terms of like the skincare stuff the dermatologist just gave me the oritane okay so after i'm done cleansing my face i'm gonna wash my face and make sure that you wash it thoroughly um and wipe my face i don't really use toner i don't really know the purpose of toner so if you know anything about skincare because i literally know nothing like literally so if you are like a professional if i may say in like skincare products and the ingredients because i know nothing about them then please educate me about toner why toner is needed um and why it's actually good for your skin because i never understood the concept of toner so i really need someone to actually explain it to me then maybe i might try to use it again because i've used it at some point but then I stopped because of the fact that, you know, I don't really see the purpose of toner. And plus, uh, my skin looks good and I haven't been using toner this whole entire time. So as you guys can see over here, I am going to be using serum. So the first serum that I've ever tried was the salicylic acid serum. And this actually worked for me, you know. But the, um, the last time I went to Clicks, they didn't actually have it. So I actually went for um, the hyaluronic and niacinamide um, serum. But this doesn't work for me as much as the salicylic acid serum. And I think it's because, you know, I use the salicylic acid um, cleanser. So that's why the salicylic acid serum actually works for me. So if anything, hyaluronic acid does nothing for my skin. If anything, it makes my skin so dry. So me personally, I'm a salicylic acid girl. Um, you know, it works in both the facial cleanser and it works in both the um and the serum so i definitely recommend salicylic acid for myself but as for you you're gonna have to try them for yourself because that's how it was for me 
but at least i've only tried one serum after the salicylic acid so now i know that i am not gonna try any other serum except for salicylic acid because that is what works for me that is what my skin loves and so therefore that is my go-to all the time after the serum i then go in with my CeraVe moisturizing lotion um and i mix that in with my sunscreen the thing with the sunscreen you guys is that it actually like leaves a white cast on your face so i'm really like adamant on like leaving the sunscreen and actually trying something else but this is a sunscreen that was actually recommended by my dermatologist um and honestly i really feel that it like works for me because i used to have so much dark spots now i like literally don't um you guys are gonna see now that i'm applying it that it's actually gonna like leave a white cast on my face but that's something that i actually try to fix you know um i want to get a new sunscreen but as i said this was recommended by my dermatologist and i actually trust him because if it wasn't for him honestly my skin would look the same way it did in the beginning of the video you guys saw that and the only reason why like the way i moisturize my face looks rough is because i'm not rough nay but i just want to like work fast with it because as i said the sunscreen does leave a white cast on my face so i want to make sure that i work as quickly as possible to make sure that i don't have any like white cast on my face whatsoever so yeah that's the reason you guys see me do that so yeah guys that's literally my skincare routine nothing else i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and i'm um, recommend more video ideas because this was actually recommended by someone and you know i just decided to make the video because i wash my face each and every single day so i mean why not yeah and this last clip is me showing you guys what my skin looks like because the lighting in the bathroom was actually very bad so yeah thank you guys so much for watching bye